hot on the heels of the iPhone 5S's release, Samsung will be releasing the Note 3 phone tablet next week. It's not revolutionary, but its changes does make the latest in the tablet series also the greatest. The first Note won over many iPhone users looking for a bigger screen. The Note 3 has a slightly bigger screen than the Note 2, at 5.7 inches, but sometimes bigger does not mean better for those with small hands. Thankfully, the phone is slightly thinner than previous entries, and at 5.9 ounces, it's even lighter than the 6.4 ounce Note 2. The Note 3's best feature by far has not been talked about a lot, the ability to shrink the screen size for smaller hands. With a zigzag or quick in and out gesture at each side of the screen, you have everything at your reach. And you know what? It is even customizable as well. Note 3's display is visibly brighter. With power saving turned off and at full brightness, the Note 2's display is duller, with whites coming off a little bit yellow in comparison. On top of the Android 4.3 Jelly Bean OS, Samsung has optimized the stylus' features. Pulling out the S Pen brings up Air Command, a floating menu wheel with three features that might come in handy. Building on top of its S Note app, Action Memo is smart enough to recognize the data you write. Via the Action Menu, contacts information or addresses, for example, are recognized by apps, making things that much faster. The scrapbook feature is an easy way to keep what you like in one place. See a website or a YouTube clip you like, draw a circle with your S Pen, and the URL and screenshot is saved into your scrapbook. If it's specifically a photo you circled or a video, the media will be played within your scrapbook. Lastly, the multi-window mode is better than ever. Unlike the Note 2, you can now open two instances of the same app in multi-window. Feel like watching that Miley Cyrus video alongside Katy Perry's Raw? You can do just that. It even looks better in landscape. Or if you want to attach a photo to a message, enabling the drag and drop function between windows allows you to do just that. Aesthetically speaking, the Note 3 comes with a more squarish face, which looks more like the first Note. Its rear finish is a departure from the smooth glossy finish of the Note 2. Although still made of plastic, the back cover has a more textured feel, mimicking a leather notepad. The Samsung Note 3 is scheduled to be released on the 28th of September, with pricing yet to be announced.